subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos hey what's up youtube this is wasi here and today in this video i'm going to show you how you can solve the problem that your video starts from the beginning again and again or it glitches in premiere pro so let's begin the video so before i begin to tell you how you can solve this problem i should tell you why it happened in my case or why it may be happening in your case so i saw that this uh, video glitch where the video begins from the start again and again in premiere pro happens when mostly you have videos that you recorded from your apple devices like your iphone etc so i mostly encountered this problem when i had screen recordings from my iphone or video made from my iphone and when i imported it in my windows pc and imported in premiere pro so then it glitched and start over again meaning that premiere pro isn't very good with apple codex anyway so this is the main thing i think in which you're going to face the problem that is when you're going to have recordings with apple products anyways there are different ways that you can solve this problem so let's move towards our windows pc so first of all you can see here i have the video on my timeline so this is a 4k video at 60 fps which i recorded from my iphone 12 pro now if i play the video you're going to see that the video is going to play back from the start so here you can see so here i just press the button and now you're going to see is that the video just looped back from the start so this is the thing that is happening in this whole video the loop will start again and again although uh, i run the video on my windows media player and everything is all right but when i import it i'm having this kind of problem so the first fix is that all you need to do is to close premiere pro and reopen premiere pro it's going to solve the problem in many cases but if the problem is still not solved there are different ways that you can do so so the second way that you can solve this glitching problem is that you can actually render the footage that is glitching like this is the video clip that was glitching so you can actually render this particular clip in premiere pro this may solve the problem in many cases but it's not 100 percent surety like it solved my problem in, with 50 percent of the footage and not with the remaining 50 so it's a 50 50 chance with it but it's uh, worth to try so in order to render it all you need to do is to go to the very start of the click clip press i to set the end point we're going to go to the very end of the clip right here we're going to press o to set the out point from here we need to go to the top left side we are going to press on sequence render into out so now it's going to render our footage uh, again the rendering will take some time depending on your clip size uh, resolution and also the speed of your rendering machine so i'm not going to render it so this is the second way that you can solve the glitching problem the last and final way that i found which worked mostly for me is that uh, you need to convert the video format so like uh, the video which i have if i show you in the raw format here it is which is actually glitching in premiere pro if i go to properties you can see that it is a dot mov format which is apple's uh, format so what i did i actually converted it converted it to a dot mp4 format here is the converted file if i go to detail uh, in general you can see that it is a dot mp4 file and the dot mp4 file worked in premiere pro without any glitch so you can get many uh, converters uh, online so you can uh, use vlc media player as well which is uh, fully free but unfortunately vlc media player wasn't working for me so instead i used another software here it is prism video file converter so i converted the my video file completely free so it's free of cost for some trial version i think so anyways here is the interface so if you want to download it here is the website i will put this website link in the video description so what's cool about this software is that you just need to add your dot me or v file which is actually glitching in premiere pro so we're going to press on add file from here here is our dot mov file we're going to press on open so first of all it's going to import it where for the output here you need to select dot mp4 which is very important so you can see we got a lot of different formats available we are going to press on dot mp4 you are going to save to the folder meaning wherever you want to save once you select the format all you need to do is to press on convert and again this will also take time depending on the size and resolution of your video but this process uh, worked 
100% for me like whichever video was glitching in Premiere Pro I converted it to .mp4 or any other format and it actually worked for me so guys these are the two ways in which you can solve the problem when the video starts from the beginning again and again in Premiere Pro hope you guys like this video if you guys like this video please give this video a thumbs up if you have any kind of questions regarding this video write them in the comment section below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so other than that thank you for watching and stay safe